Today we will be talking about prime factorization using the ladder method. With this method, we use a division process, but we divide by prime numbers. So first we must remember what our prime numbers are. So on the top of our page, we will write 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, etc. That should be sufficient for what we need. The first number we're looking at is the number 12. And we need to decide if we can divide by 2. Does 12 divide by my first prime number 2? Yes, it does. In this method, the answer does not go on the top. It goes under the 12. 12 divided by 2 is 6. And I repeat that process. Does 6 divide by 2? Yes, it does. 6 divided by 2 is 3. Does 3 divide by 2? No, it does not. So now I go to my next prime number. Does 3 divide by 3? Yes, it does. 3 divided by 3 is 1. And when you've reached an answer of 1, we know we have completed our problem. The final answer will be out here. And remember, we were talking about prime factorizations, and factors are multiplications. So my answer is 2 times 2 times 3. And if you want to check that problem, we can multiply it. 2 times 2 is 4. 4 times 3 is 12, and that was the number I began with. So 2 times 2 times 3 is the prime factorization of 12. Let's try that again. Let's look at the number 70. Does 70 divide by the first prime number 2? Well, yes it does. But, I'm not sure I remember how many times, so let's go to the side and work out the division. 70 divided by 2. Does 7 divide by 2? 3 times. 3 times 2 is 6. 7 minus 6 is 1. Bring down my 0. 10 divided by 2 is 5. And 5 times 2 is 10. Subtract, remainder 0. So 70 divided by 2 is 35. And I look at that process again. Does 35 divide by 2? Well, since it ends in a 5, no, it does not. So I move to my next prime number. Does 35 divide by 3? 3 plus 5 is 8, but 8 does not divide by 3. So no, I cannot divide 35 by 3. Let's move to the next prime number, 5. Does 35 divide by 5? Yes, it does, since it ends in a 5. 35 divided by 5 is 7. Does 7 divide by 5? No, so I move to my next prime number. Does 7 divide by 7? Yes, 7 divided by 7 is 1. And I've reached 1 on the bottom, so my final answer is 2 times 5 times 7. And if I want to check that, 2 times 5 is 10, 10 times 7 is 70.